Chess friends, how are you? Today I come with a genius chess engine named Ethereal, which is so popular around the world. Today, I played a massive game with it, and this game is just fantastic. You are going to observe a true masterpiece of 2024, so let's go. I started the game with e4 and he played c5, here you can go with knight f3, the most popular line in Sicilian and something like in the open variation of Sicilian, if your opponent plays a6 which is called can variation. Play bishop g5 and put your another bishop on c4, these two bishops are like two muscular hands, continuously punching in black's face, e6 and if black dares to kick out your bishop, give your bishop to him because intelligent people don't greed for material or people. Knight d5 and if black dares to capture the knight instead of moving back the queen he will fall in our trap, queen d5 will target at your rook, queen blocks knight takes check takes check and it will be a checkmate in three moves. Congratulations you have learned a new chess opening trap to defeat your opponent like a goat, like the video now because you are gonna dive into the ocean of brilliant moves, knight c3 by me, that's a closed Sicilian line and after bishop b5 knight d4, bishop c4, we have the traditional line of Sicilian region, do you know a fact, the things you constantly think about, eventually become a part of your reality, so think positively, think like stockfish. Knight e2 attacks the center and if you lock down your center then it will be easily targeted by the c-pawn right, you need some detergent to clean the germs of clothes in your washing machine which is why ethereal played queen c7, rather than playing a5 b5 or improving the knight he goes for immediate attack with f5, weakening his two light squares but his strategy is that, after your play some healthy moves, bishop e6 will attack at your h-pawn. You can say that I can move up pawn and where is the attack, well, after black plays castle he have a good compensation with f5 to open up the file, on the other hand he have two crisscross sword champion to slay white's king, for this reason I first captured the pawn, forces black to capture my h2 pawn, and now if he becomes greedy and capture the f pawn, he slips down on the surface after eating, and throwing away his own banana peel, you will lose the bishop and the game. So ethereal moved back his bishop, I played f5, f5 move strategy is to disconnect the pieces activity in this diagonal, play knight g5 securely to run him in a garden, the queen and bishop will get atom missiles to declare was against the king, so bishop d6 and rather than capturing the pawn I decided to develop my pieces because black can't capture the f pawn himself as it will open up the eagle's eye and some source of weaknesses, so castle knight g3 to bring out the queen. Knight e4 is a threat to push the f pawn and launch a heavy attack in black's king, just observe how it goes, black played knight e7, queen h5. Black slides the king and I got a chance to put my knight on e4, f6 is a big threat as well as you bring your rook through this balcony, both moves are like stock investment, you invest your money, now you will get the results whether you gain profit or loss something, playing any normal kind of move as black will lose the position, as the knight can jump into the g5, h6 knight f7 check, black tried to defend his king in h7 but rook e1 will come to ride the horsey, and look at your majority of pieces. It's doing nothing, instead of standing there like a gatekeeper, robbers come and rob jewelry, but they stand like pillars, we will sacrifice the rook to eliminate the knight, now you can take on f5, g6 queen h3 to attack it, h5 f5 to break the structure and black has nothing to do with it, if you were playing against a human in this position there would be a chance to come back in the game but in the highest level of chess, even if you made any inaccuracy your game will be dead, like this. Queen g6 checkmate. Each day is a new chance to be a better version of yourself, choose to be great today, so back to the position, ethereal said, each day I grow myself into a new version, let me capture the pawn with knight, well my than gas, face my g4 attack, if you move back your knight on h6, f5 will make a video call between the knight and bishop, f6 is also a threat, and your king has no defending piece to secure the game, his bodyguards are all in the red cube, like a retired radio and black and white television. So if the knight moves back, g5 will come anyway, white need to play rook f3 and rook h3, if black captures the pawn then g6 will be a miserable issue, h6 and you can capture the h pawn after eliminating the g8 knight, the game is completely yours and friends, if you are enjoying my content, then please like and subscribe to my channel, I need your support, black played knight e3, 
Rook goes to f3 to reach at his destination, Black should have gone for bishop e7 and he played a mistake move b5. The reason why this is a mistake because after take take I get the chance to play knight g5, that's why he should play bishop e7 to stop the knight entry, to h6 by force, queen g6, forcing black to capture the knight which is why I get the open file on h file, king runs rook h7, rook f7 queen g5, all are forcing moves which black is playing, I have calculated all these variations and now I get the hypnotized g7 g5 check to force black to play another mistake, but he did no, so rook h7, no draw. Queen takes f7, queen c3 check, if the queen blocks on c6 then I can capture the e-pawn, this is a very natural tactic to get two connected pass pawns, so king b6 rook h3. Focus on what you want to achieve and let life guide your way, f5 is coming and if you move back your king, just to put him in 5 star security, rook h5 will come, bishop c7 queen d4 check, king can't go back to b8 because of rook b5, that's dangerous so after bishop b7 rook takes check here. Check takes queen takes e3 and that's it, white have rook and pass pawn which is enough to win the game, so in this position ethereal tried to do queen exchange with me, I have no queen escaping square and it's better to exchange the queens because after all, I am up material, he played a nice game with me but you know what, father always be a father, a son can't defeat him, I am the godfather of chess and I proved again that nobody in this Milky Way galaxy can defeat me in chess. So wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.